Well, here's my solar array. And there's my second solar array. We're going to have a combined 56 panels. We still got to get out here with some zip ties and do some stuff. But this is just a, I just got to make sure that these breakers are all off. I'm going to hook up these panels. Yes, they're all off. There's three different strings here. Eight panels per string. These are 330 watt panels. Don't want to be shocked while I'm messing with my solar panels or, you know. And these are all on. I'll turn off all of our solar input I'll make sure I pick up that other cover <laughs> we'll strike with the zip ties and stuff after we make sure everything's going to work and uh, be sitting the way we want it. But, there they are. So, we have 24 back there and 32 up here. Gives us a total of 56 panels. I'll, uh, those are only 330 watts. These are uh, 370. So there is, you know, these have to be wired to different inverters. I cannot mix those. These will be wired to separate inverters. These and these will be wired up to separate inverters. Anyways, on we go. Okay, we just fired it back up after uh, after we uh, hooked up all the solar panels. So uh, two strings in the center have the uh, new solar panels hooked up.
The one over there on the left, that one's got one of the old ones hooked up. And the one on the right has one of the old the old panels hooked up. The two center ones have the new panels hooked up. They are only 330 watt panels. The ones on the, the two far ends are the ones with the 370 watt panels. So it's probably not going to be charging any faster. Let's. Let me get this over there. The racks are so tall. That one's at 60, and that one's at 26. So we're still only at 86 amps, which is, that's the normal. But, this one's probably gonna be around 40. And that's normal. And that one's 15.9. And the other two are going to be pretty close to the same. Yep. 15.5. And the other one's going to be about that too. So... It's all charging at the normal rate. I just have more panels for when it's cloudy out. That's all, that's the biggest, you know, when you have a bunch of clouds and stuff like that, that's when you're gonna get the most benefit from having the extra panels. It's not gonna charge the system any faster due to this being set at 86 amps so that's and that's the way it was basically uh, set up but as soon as I get my transformer and I need to exchange that um, get the firmware put into that far right um, inverter then I'd be able to split my two system it, this, this is actually one system but it can easily be split into two I just need that I need the same firmware there and I've had a transformer on order since March from signature solar and I'm not seeing it yet hopefully they get it to me pretty soon but as soon as that happens, then I could actually have two separate systems, just take out the bus bars. And our next project will be putting together another battery to go down here. I've, I'm gonna put that battery together now that we have the uh, solar panel array up. That's something we'll start in the next day or two. But, First, I gotta organize everything in here. Seems like everything I do gets all uh, makes this little building a mess. It's not big enough for the things I'm doing with it, I guess.
anyways now that I got that stuff back where it's supposed to be I could maybe put some of that stuff away or some of this stuff I've been dragging out a bunch of tools and wires there's the tools I got my gutters put back on all the wires are in the wire way all the covers are on all the boxes I got the outside all cleaned up there's always a bunch of stuff you have to dig for and find and there's those batteries down there underneath that other inverter you know that's a bunch of my PV wire I've got PV, PV wire here and there's a red roll back there and you know things just kind of got tossed and whatnot so we'll have to organize in here and then we'll uh, try and get those batteries put in the box that I made for it so we'll uh, start working on that now that we got this part of the solar system up and running I wasn't going to do this until I got my other uh, transformer but I'm glad I went ahead and did it um, I'd still I you know I'd still be waiting on that dang transformer I, I don't know hopefully it shows up before too long I was supposed to get it in May and then I'm now and then they told me sometime here in June and who knows what's going to happen there stuff coming out of China seems to be on a very slow boat anyways please like comment and subscribe